what is happening guys my name is john or uh, john is rusty that's my channel's name and uh the stuff the stuff the item that you're watching today this is a uh, ak-74 knife review uh automatico conditioner cloth 74 i said that wrong i know uh you don't need to tell me and uh in advance sorry i have some artificial light i have my lamp set up over to the left here so there's going to be some shadows over to the right uh, you know, whatever, you gotta do what you gotta do. So, this knife, I did a little bit of research on this knife. Uh, oh, for, I, I actually haven't used it, uh, on anything yet. But, um, from, what the research that I, that I, have done. Damn, I get sidetracked a lot. Have you guys noticed that? No, you haven't, because you've never seen my videos before. But, uh, I get sidetracked a lot. So, if I start, like, a conversation, or, uh, if I start a, uh, saying... And, like, I'll talk, and then I'll randomly switch over to something completely different, or something slightly relevant. Uh, you know, that's just because I have ADD or something, I don't know, they haven't diagnosed me yet, but, um, I have something. So, that's fine, no worries. <laughs> so, whatever, damn it, this is the AK-74 knife, and, uh, I got this knife in a trade. I bought a BB gun from some, some kid at a swap meet. And I ended up walking around with the BB gun, and I walked up to these guys. They're like, hey, nice BB gun. I was like, yeah, cool, whatever. And they had a whole bunch of knives in this case, a uh, glass case, and, you know, I just ended up trading it for them. So, whatever. So let's take a look at the knife. Well, first off, this box is supposed to be uh, a banana clip, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if that has any significance. K-A-L-S-74 Des. So, here's the knife itself. You uh, open it by pressing the button up here. It comes out. It's nice. It's nice. It's very nice. Uh, because it's tan. <laughs> it's, a, it's a nice tan color. I like it. Uh, desert tan, I guess I should say. So right there, this is going to be bad. Um, you guys can't see anything because camera's not the best. And also, uh, we're inside, so the lighting's bad. But I'll try to read it for you guys. Automat Klinishnikov 74. I said that wrong once again. And then it says, what does it say? Polif, or some, something design, and then Magram. No, Magnum, I'm stupid. Um, <laughs> so that's, I guess that's who it makes it. And on the back it says, Stainless Taiwan. And I, so... That kind of transitions to what I'm going to say. I did a little bit of research on this knife. And uh, it is a cool knife. But uh, I, I, from what I've seen, that they are German. It's like a German company company that makes them. But Oh, the, the design. But uh, they outsource it to Taiwan. So, you know, no surprises there. Uh, well, actually, kind of is surprising. I don't see why they send it over to China. But whatever. Uh, or at first when I saw that it said Taiwan, I thought it was a knockoff, and I, I didn't think to look at it when I did the trade. I was like, damn it, I have a knockoff, uh, AK-74 knife. Then I did some further research, and uh, I, I'm pretty sure it's not a knockoff. So, right now I'm going to do a paper cutting test. Here's some old homework from my Spanish class. There we go, Espanol to Capitu vocabulary. Yeah, 10 out of 15, good job. John. So, I've never sharpened this. I'm pretty sure it is brand new from the guys. It didn't look like it was used. The box was like a little tiny bit beat up. You know, there's little spots where it's beat up, but that's because I, I would take it out and like kind of play with it. And it's also actually very stiff. Like, you can't do the thing where you flip it. It's pretty, uh, the screw's pretty tight. So, like I said, I never sharpened it. So, let's see what I can do. Wait, I was cutting paper earlier today, man. Come on, work with me. Okay, no, this is bad. Um, sorry, guys. There's certain... There we go. So it does cut paper. It is, uh, it can be that sharp. I don't know what else to say, guys. Have you sharpened it? The one thing I, I, I don't want to sharpen, I don't want to mess up the paint. And, you know, I'm not really going to be using it. I have other knives that I use. This is just kind of more of a novelty kind of thing I'd keep. It's just pretty cool. So, anyway, that's all I got to say, guys. Peace. Ooh, subscribe if you want to see more videos.